on this day in Abaco, we would like to know on the 17th of July, 2021, after Craig Roberts was convicted of a crime in the magistrate court in Marshaba, the next member of parliament for North Abaco, Kai Mills, would like to know, is the prime minister still have this contractual agreement with Craig Roberts, who's an American citizen, doesn't even have a contractual license in the Bahamas that I know of, is not a contract in America, but he's been acting as if he's a contractor for many years, even under the Hubert Ingram administration. This is another Hubert. This is the most honorable Prime Minister of the Commonwealth of the Bahamas. Before Craig Roberts pleaded guilty of committing a crime against an American, he had a contract with the Prime Minister. The Bahamian people, the Abaco people, the next member of Parliament for North Abaco, Kai Mills, would like to know, does the Prime Minister, or is the Prime, Min the Prime Minister, is in contractual agreement with Craig Roberts, a convicted criminal that said in the Marshall Accord, yes, I wanted to do this American harm. He got a sweetheart of a deal. He never was uh, charged with a fine. He never got a jail time. Just walk on the court like nothing happened. But he got even a sweeter deal when he was charged or he was not charged, but there was a wanted poster out for him for threats of death. It would water down to threats of harm. Oh, I didn't mean, I wasn't going to kill him, I just was going to harm him. And went into court and said, yes, he was right when he came into the police station and had a written statement with witnesses. I was going to harm him. I'm guilty. And nothing happened after that. My question that all North Abaco wants to know does Craig Roberts, is he still have contractual agreement with the Prime Minister? It came direct from the Prime Minister. Didn't go to tender that only Craig Roberts and only Craig Roberts could get the deal to repair the whole of Treasure Key sewer system. Is that contract still intact? after Craig Roberts has become a convicted criminal by his own admission, by boldly going into the Marshall Court and pleading guilty of threats of harm against an American. Is that contractual agreement still intact? after Craig Roberts walked to the court and as Clarence Russell, the big man, I think the FNM brought him back, I'm not even sure, he may be still be on vacation. There's Clarence Russell and the man in charge of Abaco, Lerota. Does Lerota know that Craig Roberts played pleaded guilty as an American in Abaco is he still allowed to help contractual arrangement with the Prime Minister of the Commonwealth of the Bahamas I can't say this enough because this is, in most countries this will be huge most country 
Craig Roberts will be deported, fought with as a non-desirable and would never be able to come into the Commonwealth of the Bahamas. I'm still on the story. The jury is already in, but the FNM government is absolutely quiet on this most important issue, Kai Mills and the residents of North Abaco want to know what is Darren Henfield take on this. Is Darren Henfield also in bed with Craig Roberts? And is this the reason why Craig Roberts has not been deported as a non-desirable after threatening an American, the same people that is putting breads on the table of most Bohemians. It's one of these Kai care. This is what I do. Bring information, correct information. This is what the Minister of Foreign Affairs, Darren Henfield, ought to be doing. Because he is there as a servant, only a servant. Not a savior, as a servant of the people of North Abaco. And such information ought not be begged to be brought forth. It should be ready, available. We're waiting. We ought to have known already, but so far, everybody has been absolutely quiet except Kai Mills. I'm going to stay on this story until we get some answer because we ought to have some answers. It's one of these Kai Care videos. On this day in Marshaba Abaco, on the 17th day of July 2021, Sabbath Saturday in Marshaba, Kai Cares. That is why I'm bringing you the correct information that you ought to have gotten from your member parliament there in Henfield. Kai Case, I'm still on the story. Wolf for Kai. This is something new that I'm bringing to the table of Abaco. You ought to have the information, especially from the people or the person that you have elected to speak on your behalf and speak to you when there's such issue like is Craig Roberts going to be deported or is he in bed with the Prime Minister after being convicted of a crime in the courts in Abaco Kai Case that's why he's here